back, my little shots and big shots. So today we'll do something slightly different, which is going down to the fish auction. We won't be cooking today, but we'll still see something special. Um, I don't know if they, if they will allow me taking videos down since it's a Muslim country, but we'll still try. Okay, guys, let's go. Um, the auction that we're going to go today is uh, really close to my house and it's on the beach so it has a really beautiful view. Alright, I can't wait for it. So I think we're going to buy one. Come on. 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 Some lime. Corn cups here are really good. They cook it perfectly. It's really tender and um, it's really nice. We're almost there, guys. Let's go. Okay guys, just give me five minutes, I'm gonna go ask uh, to the fisherman if um, I can take videos and if I can go in. Okay, they allowed me. Let's go now. <laughs> So guys, finally we arrived to the fish auction, which is also a market. As you can see here, here are the fishermen boats. They're the boats that during the night, they go out to fish and they come back in the morning. They go out when the tide is low and they come back when the tide is high. So here they fish many types of fish. Later when we'll go to the fish auction, I'll tell you. Down with your small boat, they put an engine and they go and fish. But 
But also, some of the fishermen, they go with this boat called Ungalau. They're typical Zanzibar. They dry the fish because, so it's an old method that they use. So um, the fish, even after a month, it can be good, but obviously the taste is really strong. Well, now we always want to buy some fresh fish. Let's go. Oh, that is a very beautiful fish. I think we should buy it. So here they're smashing octopus to make it more tender and they do it for about 15 minutes so it gets really soft So you also usually find this bone in the sea. So sometimes when you go for a walk on the beach, you find plenty of them. Bye.